Welcome to today's video wrinkles 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 at some time in everyone lifetime they are gonna develop some form of wrinkles now why is this this is all because the older you get the skin lose its elasticity and it loses its collagen production now what you will notice especially on your face is that you will start to develop wrinkles right around the eyes right here you will also start to develop wrinkles on the upper lips and you will also notice jawline starting to sag. Now, what are we gonna do about this? We can actually go get a surgery, get it all, you know, tighten and firm again, or you could try some natural or made remedies that are very, very effective in getting rid of the wrinkles and also in preventing you from having wrinkles and fine lines. Well, today I'm gonna share one such natural or made remedy with you. I'm gonna use just ingredient that probably is just laying around in your kitchen and I'm going to create this awesome facial mask that you can apply to your skin you're gonna notice your skin is just gonna look radiant so younger so fresher five to ten years younger in no time just plump your cheeks will be looking rosy all because you start taking care of your skin and using this wonderful remedy so if you're interested in today's video continue wrinkles on the skin our first two ingredients are right here I'm using some tomato which is known to help with fighting wrinkles on the skin and also for lightening and brightening the skin now tomato is filled with vitamin A vitamin B6 and guess what tomato is also filled with vitamin C which is great for the skin it's great for brightening the skin tomato is also great for getting rid of dead skin cells from the surface of your skin using tomato is not only gonna lighten and brighten the skin but it's gonna have your skin really soft supple and smooth our next ingredient is banana and today I'm not going to be using the flesh of the banana I'm going to be using the banana peel and banana peel when you open the banana peel and look inside after you take your flesh out all of this wonderful goodness on the inside of the peel right here is great for lightening and brightening the skin and guess what this is great for getting rid of wrinkles and fine lines so regardless of what age you are this remedy is going to work wonders on your skin banana peel is going to help to plump that skin up and while tightening the skin also so overall this is going to be a wonderful combination to brighten your skin lighten your skin and to get rid of your wrinkles and your fine lines and these are gonna leave your skin just radiant and glowing our next ingredient is yogurt and this is plain unsweetened yogurt if you are vegan grab some almond milk or almond butter those are gonna work just as well if not just grab some carrot seed butter all right now yogurt is loaded with lactic acid which is gonna penetrate the skin and it's gonna get rid of all that dead skin cells what it's gonna do is gonna leave a bright skin yogurt is gonna also tighten the skin while shrinking those large pores so this is great for your skin Now to begin the first thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna blend the tomato now if you do not have a blender do not worry go ahead use a grater and just grate the tomato you're still gonna get the juice from the tomato okay now I have a blender so I'm gonna chop this and I'm gonna blend No. 
now do not add any water to the tomato the tomato is going to produce its own juice so just put it in the blender and leave it like that if you grate it do not add any water either so here we have our blended tomato puree make sure to get everything out and this is what it looks like and this is about a quarter cup and now we're gonna move on to our banana peel so you just want to open your banana peel like I'm showing here just open it and you're gonna take a knife and what you're gonna do you're gonna press slightly on the point and you're just gonna scrape so you're just gonna scrape this banana peel just scrape so we're taking off the inner part of the banana peel okay and there we have some go back to the other end and scrape all right so there we have our first piece now you want to scrape just the peel from one medium banana so we're just scraping and this is good we're doing about two tablespoons of the banana peel and that's what you're basically gonna get from one banana peel about two tablespoons so just scrape get everything out it's pretty easy and now this is done and here we have our banana peel now what we're gonna do we're just gonna chop this just chop the peel okay finely chop the banana peel now you could also choose to blend this but I don't want to put this little bit of a thing in the blender so I prefer to chop it now if you're at home doing this and you're making one treatment you can also choose to just use a quarter of that tomato and put the banana peel in and blend okay so our banana peel is ready and it's good to go so here we have our banana peel and like I said before this is about two tablespoons of the banana peel tablespoons of banana peel, two tablespoons of yogurt. If you're using almond milk, use about three tablespoons of almond milk. Reaching for our tomato puree, and we're gonna use two tablespoons of the puree also. Now, you could put this in your refrigerator, just store it there for about seven days to use a second time. And now here are our three ingredients and we're gonna blend this together. Now, once you get to this stage, do not put this in the blender because it's gonna get really fluffy and a bit watery, which we're not looking for, okay? So just blend our banana peel, yogurt, and tomato puree together. Just make sure the banana peel is totally blended. And a wonderful thing about this is that it's not gonna get dark since the tomato acid is gonna prevent the banana peel from getting dark. Now, this is ready. This is our facial mask for getting our skin light and bright and also for getting rid of wrinkles on the skin and also for tightening those skins and getting rid of those large pores. So now I'm gonna show you how to use this wonderful facial mask for your skin. So here we have our facial mask and you wanna store this in your refrigerator. As soon as you finish making it, just store it in your refrigerator. And you can keep this in your refrigerator for about six to seven days, it's okay. Now you want to make sure to start with clean skin so you're gonna exfoliate your skin first. Now you can use just some brown sugar and some coconut oil or you can use some olive oil with some baking soda but just exfoliate your skin, okay? Now after you exfoliate, 
the skin and the skin is clean then you're gonna apply your treatment now if you exfoliate your skin on a regular you do not need to exfoliate just before you use this just make sure to exfoliate your skin at least two to three times per week okay so now here it is and today I'm gonna use my hands to apply this so you just want to be generous with it just take up an amount and just apply it to your skin just rub it on your skin in a circular motion like I'm showing here just rub it on the skin now make sure to cover your entire face with this and this is really gonna feel great on your skin okay don't forget to go down at the neck and decollete with this now rub it on your skin this is also great for your under eyes wrinkles so go as close as possible just don't let it get in your eyes Now once you apply this to the skin, you're going to let it sit on your skin for at least 30 minutes. Now you want to use this at least two to three times per week for best result. The more you use it is the prettier, the brighter, the clearer and just supple looking your skin will be. So just continue to use the treatment for better result. Now sit with this as I said before for 30 minutes and then you're gonna rinse off with some warm water. Now after rinsing this off you're gonna pat dry and you're gonna apply your favorite moisturizer to your skin. Okay? So there you have it. Give this a try because guess what? What do you have to lose? Absolutely nothing. What do you have to gain? You have a nice fresh young wrinkle free plump looking skin to gain so give it a try thank you all for watching now if you like the video don't forget to share it share it on your social media share the recipe with your friends and guess what if this was your first time watching you'd like to see more of this video well look below you're gonna see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed also for everyone watching if you look at the side of the word subscribe there's a little bell if you click on that you will get a notification as soon as I I upload a video so thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye bye